stop. And then some people might think, I think I'll just grab that. <laughs> oh, well, no, well, it's the, it's the first kiss. Would that be appropriate or is that too much? So you have to deal with these issues. So finally you figure out the embrace. You're bringing your faces together and then you realize, Oh no, I got a big no. So you now you have to now you have to turn the head. Oh, and then the oh, there's another I mean you just can't have noses collide. You get in the way, you know, like the lips will come together. So now you gotta turn your head. Hope you don't have arthritis in the neck. <laughs> you just wait. <laughs> Why are you going to the chiropractor? <laughs> anyway, oh no, I'm wearing glasses. And if the other person's wearing glasses, you could scratch the lenses and you just picked them up last week. So now the glasses have to come off. All right? Be careful where you put them. You put them in a pocket, forget about them, and then you sit down on them. Anyway, so now the glasses come off. You've got your head angled properly. You bring the lips together. And then... Now you're bringing them together. Do you come in for just the little narrow pucker? Or do you come in like the white mouth bass? Oh. I'm gonna give you mouth to mouth. Oh. And then you finally figure that out. I mean, your mind's going through all this, you know, hyper speed, because you don't want to delay and say, wait a minute, I gotta think this out. So as you're engaging in the <laughs> why are you pausing? <laughs> you finally Ashley. He needs a partner. You finally got those lips together. And then you remembered somebody said if you really want an exciting time. <laughs> you could use the tongue. This is the first kiss. Is that appropriate or not? And then you have this little debate. Tongue or no tongue? You're going, what do you mean, tongue or no tongue? Don't worry, you'll figure it out if you haven't already. And then, then, this is really weird. I mean, you think, oh, it's sex, it's arousing, it's fun, and, and your brain gets in the way. Your brain, in the middle of all this fun, comes up with this stupid question. A re First, it's a realization that leads to a question. You realize your eyes are closed. That leads to a question. Is the other person's eyes closed? <laughs> and some of you are just, you can't take it. It's like you've got to find the answer. So you open your eyes. <laughs> if the other person's got his or her eyes closed, it's okay, you can close your eyes. But you might find an eyeball looking right at you. <laughs> and if that's the case, the kiss is over right then and there. Now, once you've kissed a lot, it just becomes, especially if you have the, 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 uh, the same partner, it just goes on an automatic pilot. But the very first kiss shows you that it's not instinctual. You have to think all these things out and make very quick decisions.